Yo, what's up, squad? Check him out. It is Ultimate Volcanicus V2. And excuse me, I got a bunch of coffee and a bunch of nuts in my mouth right now. Not like that. Not like that. I'm a bunch of mixed nuts because uh, I'm on limited time right now. That's all I can eat for breakfast. But um, yeah, so check this guy out. He's pretty cool, right? He's pretty cool. Man, one of my morning builds. Highly, highly, highly suggest y'all to... um. To build in the morning, yeah. And if you're wondering where I'm in, a, uh, where I'm off to in such a rush this morning, I'm about to go watch Rise of the Biggity Biggity Beasts. So pretty, pretty cool, right? And so, um, yeah, I'm not gonna do a full tutorial on this guy because um, I ain't nobody got these parts at home. I know, I know, but at least I can walk you through them, right? And so let me give you a quick tour of Mr. Volk. We're just gonna pick up the camera, a la shaky cam style, and we'll do some close-ups on our guy. So the first thing that you may notice is that he has a Centurion drone plugged into his belly. Um, that really works in terms of like making elongating his torso uh, because without it, the legs would just be a little bit too long and gangly. And for all the additional bulk that we have on him, sorry about that, more nuts and uh, coffee in my mouth. <laughs> for, for all the gangliness of his legs, we needed something to kind of fill that out and I love it. I love it. The arms are really cool, dude. Look at that, dude. We took the design that G Xerox X, G Zero X2 had made for the legs, and I reconfigured it to become the shoulder. And then I added the scar um, forearm there, and I think that looks really cool. Maybe some like Super Sentai vibes, or even almost like the Macross vibes, where they have the Daedalus and the Pr Prometheus plugged into the forearms. That's kind of cool. Legs are really, really nice. You know, they're all sorts of weird looking, but with great angles, you know, like he has this like reverse bend on it. You know, I think that's really cool. And that takes two Grimlocks. Yeah, on this thing, there are six Sace, Sace Grimlocks, right? There is one Slug, one Sludge, uh, and two Scars, but... I think he looks really good, man. And if you get your hands on these dinos, yeah, do more than just the regular uh, default modes. Just play with them, mess around with them. Yeah, they're really, really great for that type of stuff. Everyone have a great day, okay? Bye-bye.